hello what's up today in this video i want to show you how to create a retarget ad this is the ad i run on google and i had about 266 clicks so i want to target these people on facebook so i will target these people that clicks on my ad and i want to do that on facebook and let me show you how i will do that Okay, so uh, what I will do now is create ad and I'm going to give it a name um, income message and the auction function the traffic I'm not I'm not going to use traffic I want to use message and the ad set name ecom message ad set and the ad name ecom ad and save as draft okay. let me edit the the ad set okay i will spend my daily budget will be five dollars per day then here yeah, i want to select the audience i will use a uh, save audience and this is the audience i will use that is those who visited my website and this is highly targeted because it is only the people that visited my website which are among those people that click on my ad on google these are the people i want to target those who visited my website and that is all i'll leave the age i believe if they are if they are not ready to pay for it they would have searched for it on google so i'll leave the age and leave any other thing then i'm not going to save the audience the audience is already there i'll leave it as automatic then i want to control the cost here let me use zero point for conversion i will use 0 0.01 that's per conversion and let me select the the ad now I will use video and I'm going to upload the video and this is the video I want to use the video is uploading okay my video is as finished uploading let me use the Let me edit the video. I want to select my my thumbnail. I'll select the thumbnail. I'll use manual. I'm going to upload my own image. Okay, this is the image I want to use, but the image is not, it has cut the image, so it's not properly 
I need to work on it. So I will go to Photoshop and work on this image. And let's see. I think this is far better. This is better. And let's save it. Okay, let's type the I'm going to type the primary text now then I'll fill all these spaces 